Well, from rough bays to this rough journey <laughs> this morning, a dog who wandered more than 1400 miles from home is on his way back to right here in South Florida. He is his name is Simba and he's from Miami. Reporter Blake Keller has the story of how he was found all the way in Michigan. It was a typical day for Chris Gibson. She was at her Mount Morris Township home on March 5th in her normal routine, letting her dog outside. I let my dog out and I went back uh, to let him in and there was another dog. Just one day after sweet Simba here was found, they brought him over to the Mayfair Animal Hospital and they found out some shocking news. I couldn't believe that he was from Florida. Um, still trying to figure out how he got all the way up here. I don't think we'll ever know. It even amazed some staff at Mayfair Animal Hospital. We had all seen recently a story on, on the news about a dog that was uh, cross country and we were like, oh my gosh, that's so crazy. That would never happen here. And then a couple weeks later, here we are. Mayfair staff was able to track down his owners who live about 1400 miles away in Miami. They say the two-year-old Presa Canario had been missing for over two months. The owners were very happy he's been missing for two and a half months, so they're excited to get him back. None of this was possible without Gibson's quick thinking and Simba's microchip. Staff at Mayfair says there's a few misconceptions about microchips. They don't have any type of GPS in them at all. What a microchip does is it contains your information and your pet's information. Gibson says Simba's microchip made all the difference. The dog gets away and sometimes they never find them. Um, it's really one of the only ways you can get your dog back. That was Blake Keller reporting this morning. It's still not clear how Simba got all the way up to Michigan or who let the dog out.